Okay, so here we are again with um, uh, the best of one deck. I'm trying that again, and it's going to be blue white control. A little bit different than the last one I tried. Um, sabotage, less of the life gaining cycle. Treasure map instead of anticipate. But other than that, not too much is different. I will have the deck list in the description this time for, for real Z's. So don't worry about that if you are interested in playing this in best of one. It's actually a pretty solid deck. Um, I've been winning quite quite a lot with it. I went like 7 and 1 with one of those constructed events. So let's see if we can do something like that again. And yep, let's go. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I like this deck. It's uh, quite satisfying to play. Uh, kind of plays like Esper or Jeskai, but a little bit less in the spot removal department and more on just like the grand sweepers and draw cards <laughs> angle. All right, we got a treasure map in the opener. Good uh, time to test the card. We also have a pretty pretty uh, good curve. Actually, two, three, four, five. All right. Treasure map, I'm sure we'll find us lands. Let's hope we're not against mono red. We're against a turn one lane or elves. That's annoying, but that's how it is. Let's hope it's maybe mono green and not Sultai. Oh, it looks like mono green. Do they have a three drop? No three drop. Branch Walker? Pelt Collector. Okay. They could next turn cast um, Vivian Reed and blow up the treasure map, so... I'm not going to scry in our upkeep, because I want to cast this. We do have a settle, though, and I imagine we'll have the time to cast it. Revitalize, running Dovin's Acuity. Oh, Dovin's Acuity! That's right, that's the card I was thinking about. I said I was actually going to run that card instead of... Um... Ah, whoops. Funny you bring that up. Dovin's Acuity. I forgot about the card again. Well, definitely... Okay, alright. Definitely keep that in mind for next time. Also, we're... If they don't swing all out, we're kind of screwed. <laughs> I don't know how much they respect Settle the Wreckage. Probably enough to not swing all out, especially when it's not necessary. Oh my god. I actually don't know how to beat a follow-up to after... Post-Settle, uh, we might be in a bit of a pickle. Whoa, no respect. Oof. Well, they get a lot of lands, so they're not mana screwed anymore, but, uh, got him. Oh, my God. Okay, that's not good. They're not mono green. <laughs> oh no. Oh dear. This isn't good. Yeah, I actually do like Dovin's Acuity. Works really nice with Revitalize and stuff. Completely forgot about the card. Again. Okay, Domri, no answer to that. Planeswalkers are a bit of a challenge to deal with. Mm. Yeah. They did get lands, though. They did get red and blue. Looks like they're going to haste out a, uh... Actually, they can put a counter on it and just immediately get the other one. Headphones are slipping. 
Yep, that's actually what they do. Might upkeep scry, depends what we find. Oh, it has double. That's right, because of the rhythm. Double, uh... A uh, bit, kind of bit in trouble here. Creatures are uncounterable, so I can't attack them in that angle. Let's just run out Escata, I guess. And, uh, untap land? Hmm. Alright, maybe they'll respect Settle again? I don't know. For some reason I thought I, uh, had a treasure map activation, so I, but I don't, so I... Could have just played a tap land there. Oh my god. Um, are we dead? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten? No, we're not dead. Wait, what does this do? And then you may cast it? Okay, sure. We could have died if they used Domri mana to give this second riot. It'll be attacking as a seven, seven? Oh no, they have another threat in hand. Okay, so... I, I absorb this to gain three life. This swings for three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If we're at 14... Okay. I'll gain the three life here. Twelve. So we stay alive. I could have banked on them playing around Settle the Wreckage, but I don't want to do that. Okay, they didn't find anything off the top. It's only a matter of time. Okay. Shh. Don't make too much noise. Damn it. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. They got both their planeswalkers. They don't go to minus. They're not interested in blowing up all their stuff here. They can't adapt again. They shocked themselves. One, two, three, four... Oh, wait, no! Okay. They stole Teferi. Ugh, I should have scried first. Should have scried first. Damn. At least we're alive. Hopefully they run out of basics. Okay, they have a ridiculous amount of basics in their deck. And they have triple counter, uh, triple planeswalkers. And I have no answer to any of them. I don't think there's any answer in my whole deck.
Minus my own Teferi? Oh, I guess I can Teferi minus. Yeah, that is an answer. How many do I have left? Two? They're going to find threats every turn, though, and I don't think I'm going to be able to beat that. Uh, I mean, I have to beat the board first. I can't... I mean, this is... I gotta... I gotta... I have to do something. I don't think we're gonna win this. They're drawing, like, eight cards a turn. And everything has haste and trample and vigilance and is a 6-6. Six, six. They can just slam us with a 10-10 Krasis next turn with haste. Flying trample. Yeah, we're we're done, skis. Triple riot. Yep, we're done. That sucks. We we put up a really good fight with the double settle the wreckage, but couldn't capitalize. All right, off to a bad start. If we didn't settle, oh no, we would have died because their board was huge. But they needed the lands. The backside of uh, settle the wreckage. Ended up mattering quite a mu uh, quite a bit there. All right, this hand uh, works. We just need to land. This is this is the game plan. Doing it. Okay, I'm gonna assume this is Esper. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, I have no respect for a turn like Quench or Syncopate. They could be there, but if this gets... Eh, let's not cast it. Screw it. Let's just not cast it. I don't want Syncopate to do something. Alright. Well, I imagine they have a bit more counter spells than we do. They did shockers the, themselves and do nothing. Okay, they do it again, so probably chemistries instead of... Um, counter spell. No. Double counter spell, maybe? Interesting time to shock. I guess it doesn't matter. We're not really attacking their life total. Alright, Counterspell of our own is good. If they did have a Teferi, they declined to go for it, respecting counter magic, probably. We really just need more counter spells. I can attempt. No, no, I'm not. I'm gonna represent double counter. If they stick it to fairy, we unfortunately have a hefty amount of dead cards. They did not hit a land there. Alright, that was good. I'm going to shock, and now we have a chemistress. That's exactly what we're looking for. One, two, three. They have six. All right, we took the mana advantage, took the mana lead. If they don't play a card, they have to go to discard, and that means I might just not cast this, so they don't have a... No, actually, if they are countering this, then um, they're taking down mana, and I think that's fine. Yeah, they probably agree. Wow, this is actually just guy control. Hmm. All right. I'm interested if they want to get rid of this. It 
So they have negate. So I don't think that was a good thing to go for a turn two. I, I just did not trust it. Here we're, we have things we want to get rid of in our hand. Kind of. These could kill niv or Crackling Drake, but I'm going to assume I don't need to worry about that. Discard, uh, probably a Settle. We need more counter spells if we want to go for anything. Or if our opponent, like, smells weakness and does not go for Teferi, we're in a bit of a pickle. Or does go for a Teferi, I should say, my bad. Okay, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One more minute, and we can double counter to defend Teferi. But if we lose, we have to beat a Teferi of the opponent. I don't know if we can do that. They have a lot of non-blue sources, though. That's a good sign. Let's draw for land. I don't think this is going to go to decking. I mean, it could, but I don't think we're going to win that anyways. Could just go for a Teferi and not try to defend it. Could just do that. Start getting counter spells out of their hand. Yep. I'm gonna wait for a turn where they don't have negates. Maybe it's just three minute counter spells, because I think I can beat those. Whoa. They're Teferiing with only one counter spell out. They don't even try to defend it, because they have to worry about our Teferi. So I think what happened there is they didn't think we had another counter spell to defend Teferi with, or something, and they don't want to defend their own. No. Wow, they just probably assumed we didn't have another counter spell then, or something. You know what? I'm not done yet. Okay, well this is really good. Sure. I'm curious what their answer is to this. Shocking themselves. Explosion? Yeah, no. Oh, there's all the chemistry's insights. Dawn of Hope is really good here. Especially Don Hope that gets to stick. Hold that thought. They could have Cleansing Nova. So that is a reason to not go for both at the same time. I'm actually going to do that. Another X spell, maybe? Yep, that's gonna flip. Fight with fire, four and six. No. Let's get rid of a land again. I actually kind of want this. Nah, I already have one in the end. Tezzeret, that's good. Keep up the pace. Let's see what they do against this. I think this will be over. How many counter spells do we have left? Two. There's two more absorbs in there somewhere. Artifacts and enchantments? Sure. I 
I'm gonna make one lifelink token so I don't die to like more fight with fires and stuff. Let's get rid of Settle. We are getting kind of low on cards, but uh, I think that's totally fine. No time for a break. Oh, I forgot Lyra was in the deck. My device is finished, as I guess I'll run out of Lyra. Uh, sure, they have to keep attacking what we're doing. I don't have to even counter a, a Cleansing Nova. I can just let that happen and then just win with Teferi Ultimate. Ixalan's Binding? Nope. I'm attacking my opponent at just too many angles. Yeah, this is a uh, best of one. Doing a constructed event. I don't know what they could have at six mana. All right, we got the ultimate. Let's see if there's a settle of wreckage. I don't really care. Yep, opponent just can't beat that. All right, we just kind of swiftly handled whatever was going on there. Just guy fight with fire something. We had enchantments, creatures, planeswalkers, and they just couldn't uh, keep up. They went for a sorcery speed to fairy, but didn't have a counter spell backup. I'm so not used to just going right into the next game here. We just don't know what we're up against yet again. I think this hand is good enough. It just needs another white source. Uh, well, two lands and one of them being a white source. And it's uh, pretty good, so I'm going to keep it. Swamp. Oh, boy. Swamp. Huh. Oh boy. I think Esconce is a bit better than uh, Treasure Map here. Opponent is impressed. Oh! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Easy! <laughs> okay. Alright, so they couldn't handle the uh, search for Esconce on turn two. And swiftly concede it. I imagine they were like mana screwed. They could have been a not mono black deck and just somehow only got. Got uh, those. Okay, it's, it's kind of similar to what just happened. Uh, need two more lands. Don't have to be any specific color. We're on the play as well. I like this. Escanta. Alright, kittens. Mono white. Mono white, sure. Don't to Johnny Pride Mate, please. Don't you... Oh, come on. Alright. This is like the god opener. Ah, uh, that's the fourth land. Need land, so I'm gonna keep it. I could have represented Absorb or something, but I'd rather not shock myself. Okay, don't have, um... That other cat thing. That gains a life every turn. Alright. Guess we beat that. There's a Settle. I'm going to have to cast that here. I don't want to risk not hitting a land and then just losing horribly. Mentor? Whoa. Maybe I have time. Yeah, I think I actually have time. Let's just run this out. Alright, that was good. We actually did hit the land. I don't think there's much that can punish a sorcery speed chemist uh, cleansing them. Do we want the yes? Like I don't think their follow up is uh, that scary. 
They had a really good turn one, turn two. Let's see what uh, happened. A Johnny's last stand. I do want this counter spell. What does this do? Whenever a creature or planeswalker you control dies, you get a four four. Causing you to discard this. If you have a planes, you get a four four. Okay. So I can't effectively kill another creature of theirs? Oh, will they get a 4-4? Four, four? This is essentially just a slow 4-4. Four, four. I must say I've never seen that card before. I wonder what my opponent's plan is to make this be able to attack. Let's get rid of that land there. Let's see what their answer is to Lyra. They could just swing and then just, uh, Splendid Angel. That doesn't really fare well against Lyra. It gets up to five. I mean, if they have enough mana, they can do it twice. Don't think I'm gonna be concerned about that. I think I'm winning a game where Teferi's not being attacked, so... Let's just play like that. Scry. Don't think I want that. Plus. No time for a break. And pass. Double counter spell up. They can't pump this twice. Top deck luminous bonds. Ooh, okay. Don't want that to happen. Well, they can swing into turn uh create a four four. I'm gonna keep the Dawn of Hope actually. I think I'll take another treasure map. I don't see why not. I'm drowning my opponent in cards now. Actually, I can just run out Tezzeret instead. It's probably just better. Yeah. So now we can counter whatever they draw. We can guarantee flip our ultimate to fairy. Opponent almost had us there. But, uh, we found the fourth land for Settle. They can, uh, trade with the token and then lose the angel? No, they don't want to do that. Don't think I need another Teferi. I don't know what their uh, plan is at this point. Let's uh, turn Tezzeret's uh, zero into drawing two cards, because we'll get more artifacts this way with the tokens. Still one step Let's get rid of this, and... Uh, yep, that's... Uh, way, way, way over. They just couldn't uh, do anything. Alright. Steadily climbing up. Had a terrible game one, but... It's gonna happen. Can't win them all. Uh, just needs a white land, and it's good. So we will keep it. Treasure map on two will help a lot in finding that. Okay. Now we're in a spot where it's kind of awkward to activate this because we got like ritual and chemistries and stuff. Is this Grixis or this could just be straight up Grixis instead of a uh, Guildgate deck? Looks like that's the case. All right, that was a good draw. It also lets us uh, treasure map scry.
land. All right. Shock ourselves. Probably cast Ritual Scry instead of Chemistress. Depends what our opponent does. I don't want to see a Nickel Bolas, but might be in our immediate future. It is not. All right, let's do the Ritual thing then. I guess I am looking for at least one more land here. Looks like there's a counter spell or something. There's our one Tezzeret. Don't want to get rid of that. Uh, let's just get this out of the way of Bedevil, I suppose. Don't want that to get blown up. I expect counter magic, so I'm not going to develop a creature. I mean, a uh, te uh, Tezzeret. They've seen a lot more cars than us. Doesn't look like a uh, niv mizzet deck. Sphinx of Foresight. Okay, sure. What does that do? Scry one at the beginning of your upkeep? Okay. I'm not going to absorb that. I want these tokens for cards. I also want that. Well, we're finding the things we want. We just need to find time to cast them. Alright, I'm going to run out both of these here. And then, if I have to, I will just crack the clues. I mean, um, treasures to uh, counter something scary. So we will see. What up? Yeah, it'd be, at the beginning of their upkeep, they scry one. It's a 4-4 four, four that scries three if it's in your opening hand. Interesting card. I like it, but I've never seen it played before. We'll see how it fares. Hostage Taker. Okay, that's totally fine. They can hit Tezzeret for four. <clears throat> that's, uh, that's fine. I can actually zero Tezzeret and draw uh, two and sweep the board. Might end up doing that. I don't think the token we're making is that good here. Yeah, let's just do that. Draw some cards. This is a reason to never cl uh, crack one of these clues. I keep calling them clues. Treasure tokens? I have triple settle too. Now let's just do this though. No negate and pass. <laughs> If you're a Nexus deck, maybe you can just run four of them, help you uh, develop your opener hand, opening hand better. There's a card we didn't want to deal with. It's actually going to flip, and uh, I have no answer to that. That's a reason to keep settle. I mean, um, cleansing Nova instead of settle. That's a bit of a problem. Alright, found an answer. Just barely, but we got there. Oh, found a, another answer. Probably a cleaner answer. Don't have to get to Fury so low. Yeah, this is just better here. Let's make a token. Alright. Yeah, mono blue trap. Hmm. Could have another Nickel Bullis, although we haven't seen any up to this point, so that might have been a top deck. I still expect Vraska's Contempt or Bedevil or something. Okay, that's neither of those. They get rid of Essence Scatter. I'm not very scared of Ral right now. Jeez, there's all the, uh... I'm just gonna punch Ral in the face. Draw some cards. And pass the turn. Yep. Well, let's see what the wind blows in. They choose a card over a swamp. 
thought eraser. They're going to see hilarious hand. That is kind of not good. They get rid of moment of craving. It's got to be a removal spell or something. I mean, there's no reason to not do this. They know our hand. We're not representing anything, so let's just make the, the other token. Dispersal? Why did they let me plus to fairy first? Huh. Actually, let's just bounce Tezzeret and get rid of a settle. Can't quite kill Ralzarek yet. Our opponent probably uh, on the back foot here because that seemed a bit desperate. I'm definitely just going to draw as many cards as possible here. Just make sure we don't run out of gas. Alright, that was also a good hit. Found a counter spell. Bringing out the token beats. They get rid of a moment of craving again. Alright. Yep. They crunch the numbers and they realize they couldn't do anything. Seems as though there was no Bedevil or Vraska's Contempt. Man, we're going the distance here. I'm getting ahead of myself, but... You don't have to click on all your creatures? Oh, I didn't know that. I think if they have a Planeswalker, though, you do have to click on all their creatures. Alright, this hand's kind of similar as the other one. We're on the play, I didn't even realize. If they have the two attackable targets, I think you actually have to click your creatures. Because if you click that button again, it like doesn't make you swing anywhere specifically. We actually don't have Absorb Mana. Let's hope this is not a Mortified deck, but I find that uh, very unlikely. Hmm. Didn't know that. Alright, well, we're a little bit more Mortify resistant. Really need another blue land, though. At the very worst, we can start making tokens. Ah, oh, come on. At least it was no turn to discard, I guess. Can't complain too much. Let's see how annoying these tokens are. They probably have a lot of spot removal that would otherwise be totally dead, so... Alright. Please don't have a turn 5 to fairy, I guess. Turn 5 to fairy. There's nothing I could have done about this, though. How much do we respect, um... A negate here? Hmm. Not enough. <laughs> Do you this keep an eye on? Pretty sure they have a two mana spot removal spell. Must have been what that was. Obviously we would much prefer to have a Teferi, but This could be a minus into a Kaya's Wrath.
Nope. We need to move quickly. Okay, another mortify. I don't think I'd counter that anyways. Yeah, Mono Red's gonna be the last boss, wouldn't doubt it. Oh, you're right. Okay. Cool. I'm actually just gonna keep making tokens. I could keep up with Teferian cards and just zero Tezzeret, but I'd rather just flood the board with threats. I think I'm better off doing that. It's not good in the face of Kaya's Wrath, but uh, I think I'm fine with that. Our opponent is at a larger advantage with Tezzeret. I mean, Te uh, Teferi, I'd say. Also, our hands is kind of dead. Two, three, four, five, six. I'm not going to fight over that. Alright, um, that's pretty good. I can't cast Tezzeret, so... I mean, I can cast Teferi. They didn't have a counter spell when I went to... Okay, that resolved. Get this nonsense out of here. We're not trying to plus. If they invest five mana in a Teferi next turn, that is exactly where we want to put them. It'll probably end up minusing on Tezzeret, and then they'll use a removal spell on the token. Yeah, that probably makes the most sense. Teferi minus Tezzeret. Get rid of the token with a spot removal spell. Yeah. Kill the token. Or maybe not. Maybe there's no kill for the token. Oh wow, there might not be a way to kill this token. I mean, that'd be really good. Okay, I don't know why our opponent let us draw a card. They just shouldn't have let us draw off a Teferi before killing this token. That that does not seem right. Let's shock ourselves and pass. The Tezzeret ultimate is minus nine, and I get a permanent out of my library and play every turn. Like a land or a Teferi or a... Uh, Tr Dawn of Hope treasure map search for Escanta. Alright, let's get rid of a settle here. I'm not going to play around Vraska's Contempt. Alright, another counter spell. Sweet. Alright, we've uh, kind of turned this around here. I don't even care if they counter this, really. They do. Yep, let's keep making tokens, then. I want to keep applying uh, creature pressure. Especially for opposing Teferis. It makes them very difficult to work. How many counter spells we got left? Uh, four. That, I actually don't care about that. I think we can beat that. That, I do care about.
Lyra, okay. Not the best in this matchup, but not really the worst either. Let's force them to sweep the board? Hmm, maybe not. Maybe that's wrong. Yeah, I found a counter spell. Let's just do that instead. We're at 34 life. Flip Escanta. They had double Mortify for our early stuff, but they're still not out of this. Actually, don't seem interested in doing anything. All right. This is not a lot of pressure, but uh, it's better than nothing. Untap some lands. The Riscons is probably looking for... Actually, not even sure. We're attacking them on a multiple axes, so... Let's... Discard, uh... Settle? Yeah. Settle probably not doing nothing. Alright, opponent's drawing all the cards. They'll probably lead with Thought Eraser. We'll try to counter it. They try to Escanta in response, so maybe they didn't find what they were looking for? Okay, there's a negate. They're gonna find out we don't have any uh, counter spells in hand if they try to stop this. It looks like they are. But they are still kind of on the back foot. They can take Teferi. They do take to fairy, so they probably been answers the one in play, probably. Opponents at twenty three cards. Hmm. They can cast another to fairy. Okay. I can dig for a counter spell. Let's try that, I guess. Didn't hit. So they're probably minus um, Tezzeret again? Right on no, they don't. Oh, they want to keep trying. How many Tezzerets do they have? I mean, to, I keep mixing up these names. How many Teferis do they have left? The one in play. So they have one in play and then another in the next somewhere. Let's mess up Teferi's face. My device is finished, as are you. Could just minus this. Nah, let's just keep plussing. Let's force them to answer what's going on. Oof. There's two more counter spells in the deck, I think? Yes, there's two more. Okay. Sure. Probably take Teferi again. This Tezzeret ultimate's not really good here. Yeah, it's not the best. Hurry. I'm swinging all out to uh, Teferi here. I'm not gonna like split it up. There's Contempt. So they're probably going to kill Tezzeret? Or attempt to? Let's see if we can find a counter spell. Nope. Alright, they got Tezzeret. That sucks. Ah, uh, man. Alright. Do we have another Dawn of Hope in the deck? I think we do, actually.
Let's run out Lyra, force them to do something about it. Run this out. Not gonna fight over it. Pass. It's getting down to the wire here. We both have two Teferis left. I believe. Yes. Did they do this before plussing to fairy? That seems interesting. I think they want to plus first. Unless they know their whole deck. Like looping through it or whatever. No time for a break. I don't think I'm trying to defend that. Yeah, I don't think that's what we're trying to fight over. Also, I'm pretty sure there's a second one in here somewhere. We're still somehow ahead on cards, which is funny. But they have... Probably two Teferis left. I imagine they have all four. Okay. Not what we were looking for. I can't stop their te uh, Teferi from messing up ours. Ooh, that's good. Maybe they'll counter this. They countered it last time. Could just use Mortify instead of this Absorb. If they do minus Teferi with theirs, they uh, lose this Teferi because it will just straight up die. They have to do something about it. You know what? I'm not done. Oh boy, we're we're not we're not doing so good. We're also behind on cards now. Maybe not. We have to get in a spot where they can't activate or ultimate Seferi? Okay, they don't have the mana to Contempt and um, Absorb, so they might just pass first. Alright, well we're going to lose this Teferi. They should probably wait to see if Contempt will resolve before they just plus here, because if they can't find a way to stop this, they just lose. Okay, that sucks. Ooh, jeez. Yeah, this is a lot of lands. This game is looking like we might lose now, though. They have a negate? Yeah, they just have more counter spells than us. Okay, well... Let's let this resolve. Take the Revitalize, probably. It's the only thing in our hand that does anything. They guarantee get rid of this Teferi, so it's not going to flip. They have 12 cards. We have 14. Plus draw, plus draw, plus draw. That's 8. Yeah. Let's look for something. Actually, let that resolve. So we do get the absorb out of their hand. That's really good. It means our final win condition could still maybe do something here. cards 
Oh, they found Mortify? Ugh. So they had another one? And they get to blow it up before I get to flip it. Oh my god. Alright. Well, that was really, 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 really bad. That was decent. I can minus on their Teferi, but then they're back to having two, and we're having... I mean, they can just find it again. It's not... I'm just gonna plus. I don't think I'm winning in another angle. Treasure map's good, I guess. Okay. They can just immediately find Teferi again with their own thing. Yep. This is our last Teferi. They have two more. Oh, this is really down to the wire. Oh, did they whiff? Or are they thinking about it? There's not many cars to think about over, so this might have just been a whiff. No, it was not a whiff. It was the last of Fairy. Okay. Okay. They gotta be careful. They actually go for the minus. Wow. They go for the other Teferi. Wow, okay. I know my responsibility. Can they flip this Teferi in time? Eight cards left? Don't know. There's Dawn of Hope. I kind of expect a counterspell, but I mean... If there's not one, this is good. I can't play around them not having it. Like, or... Yeah, I can't do that. Oh, they had another counterspell. This actually resolved, so there's probably another Mortify? Ah, uh, that seems very strange. They want to keep the... Why did they do that? If they minus Teferi right now, they can't ultimate Teferi. Oh my god, this is crazy. I, I'm confused why this resolved. They really wanted this counterspell for the last Teferi then. That might be their last answer to it. So they couldn't handle the Dawn of Hope. I'm sure they have a sweeper or something. We're not doing anything else with the mana, so let's just, like, run this out. There's a part where I scoop. <laughs> oh, not yet. Let's see what they do. So they minus it, but did not counter it, did not mortify it, and they go to Ascanta, so... There's a Kaya. Alright, that's, uh... Not good. Not good to see. So they can actually win without Teferi. Okay. Let's try an upkeep. We can put Teferi to our hand. Cast it in the face of this counter spell. And then we'll see what their answer is to, um... I couldn't... Wow, this resolved too? What are they doing? Okay. 
Okay. Probably could not beat Dawn of Hope, but they might be able to beat Teferi instead? Is that what's going on? They can't ultimate Teferi anymore, so we're not scared of that. We're kind of just scared of Kaya killing us. We have to... F How many counter spells do we have left? That might have been the last one. One, two, three, four... Yeah, we don't have any more counter spells. We can go for Teferi ultimate still, barely. They gotta do something. Do they have more discard spells? Is it a bad idea to keep this in hand? No, they don't have any more discard. Kaya will kill us, though. Very, very slowly. But we do kind of have time. So what we're going to try to do is ultimate this Teferi. And then they'll, uh, they're going to minus their own Teferi so they don't deck out. They know these two cards because of Ascanta. They put them on the bottom. Yep, they exile some lands or whatever. It doesn't matter. Sure, sure, sure. Go for the old deal 20 twice or something. They actually plus again. This is the last of Fairy. There's a Lyra still. I didn't even realize that. Can't defend it. We're still interested in ultimating Teferi. Let's see if there's another Mortify? Whatever their answer is to this Lyra, it's it's in their hand now. They have all the cards they're going to have for the rest of the game in their hand. Oh, come on. They have to minus Teferi. They have to. Kaya's Wrath. I can't do anything about that. But I can still ultimate Maya Teferi and stop their Kaya. Hmm. Okay. Draw plus draw. Oh no, we're one card short. No. No. Mm. Kai is going to kill us. So they just keep flipping, they keep looping Teferi, Kai keeps ticking up and drains us out, and I can't ultimate Teferi in time before I deck out, and I have no follow-up. Okay, I plus Teferi... 
then I ultimate it. If I ultimate to fairy now, we just lose, right? Yes. <gasps> wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Ultimate. Okay, hold on. Ultimate, right? All right, we're gonna get the counter spell out of their hand just, just for the sake of doing it. Land, Dawn of Hope. We have no way to stop this absorb. Oh my God. Okay, so they're gonna, they're gonna absorb this. I think I found the out. Okay, so they're gonna go to. Wait, this resolved? Really? Are you serious? I mean, I can just win with that. But that's not the point. Alright, so they go to Teferi Minus on itself, and then we draw a card from the Treasure Cove and win. This is By. Fight you oh no, wait. By one card. By one card, because we have two cards left. Draw a card. Teferi Trigger. Exile to Fairy. There it's gone. It's not going to minus on itself. That's the last to Fairy. We got one card to draw still. Sure. <gasps> yes. Oh. Yes! Tell me to scoop. Get out of here. <sighs> oh, man. I don't know what I just did, but yes! Oh, that was like 40 minutes. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh. oh, man. Can't stop it. Can't stop me. Can't stop me. That could be a YouTube video all in its own, man. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh. Oof, I gotta relax. We're back to not playing against Esper, probably. Imagine that was be imagine that was best of three, and we had to do that again. <sighs> now I'm on a red. Not yet. We're not. We're not at the end. We're gonna. We're gonna go all the way here. I'm gonna keep this hand. I think it's good. The revitalize is good. Opponent's down to five as well, so. And they have a Lanterwood Elves. Look at that. Mold of five, and they still open game one with the Lanterwood Elves. Alright. Hopefully we can uh, capitalize on them not playing an Explore card, please? Nice. We also have Settle the Wreckage now, I guess. Midnight Reaper. Alright, Settle the Wreckage just got significantly better. Oh, yeah, Mold of Five. Good sign. They don't swing at the Lanor Elves. Okay, they do. They thought about it, so maybe there's a four man of Raska or something, and they, they might not have wanted to cast it. Oh boy. I gotta come down off of that excitement now. Okay, they declined to swing with Lanor Elves this time. We're still gonna snap this off. Let's see if they're Sultai. I think they have either a Vivian Reed to cast or a 
uh, four men of Raska. That's the only thing I can think of that costs four. Oh, and there might not be basic islands, so they still could be Sultai. Either way, I'm pretty sure there's a four minute card here. Okay, it's Vivian Reed. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I've seen things. Would you like to see what's left of Scar? Well, this is actually really bad. I can't stop Carnage Tyrant. I guess I should have chemistered sorcery speed to look for a land to play right there. That was probably wrong. Another car oh, come on. Yep, I should have played a land there. Should have just snapped. Because we knew what their their turn was. So it was just going to be that. Might have to cast a... Uh, I'm going to Teferi Minus on Vivian Reed so they stop doing ridiculous things. And then use... Uh, use... Uh, settle the wreckage to stop the Carnage Tyrants. Although I don't think they're going to swing with both at the same time. I imagine they'll cast both though. Six, seven. This is definitely one face. I doubt they're going to play the other Carnage Tyrant. Alright, so... Dawn of Hope helps, but I think... Search helps better. Lyra will just let us die. I'm not chumping with Lyra. Alright, let's run this out. Pass. They don't actually die here if I just revitalize and they don't swing at Lanor Elves or something? This doesn't even answer the, uh... Vivian Reed in their hand. I mean, on the top. I'm not even like that far ahead. I guess the only thing that stops Vivian Reed is me making them shuffle, but they might just decline the shuffle. Don't know what more Lance does for them instead of just a Vivian Reed. They don't swing with Lanor Elves, though. So. No, I'm still doing this. This could potentially make them shuffle. If they wind up doing that, that's really good. Unless they have another Vivian Reed, then the shuffle is actually better for them. They just don't want to draw another one. They get rid of Vivian Reed. I imagine their game plan is Carnage Tyrant. Okay. We're looking for... Uh, Cleansing Nova? Okay. I'll take that. <laughs> oh my god. Can't leave up counter magic though, but I'm, I, I, this is like my only answer to this. and this, Gotta do this. Are you gonna kill it? They're gonna kill it? Okay. So their game plan is to just do that again. The uh, next turn with the memorial. Sure. Get to run out of Lyra here. I don't think they want to do this right now. If I go like Black Source Thought Eraser, maybe I am Esper. You don't want to put that to your hand, but you don't have to. It's a small thing and Maybe they just want to do it, just make sure they don't forget. That's totally reasonable. Alright, we do get to develop a Lyra, though. And flip Escanta, so we're not in a bad spot by any stretch. We actually found Absorb Mana, too, so this is really good. We can counter anything. We can't really race Carnage Tyrant, but... Uh, we're not in a bad spot here with the Lyra. Yep. 
It looked like they were thinking about doing something else and they declined. I'm not going to counter anything that doesn't interact with Lyra. Alright, so we swing, because we're not really blocking. Gain five. Guess we can just chemisters. Maybe Escont is just better, Escont activation. What do we chemistry? Oh, let's just do this. Kind of need lands. The lands are good. I already played a land. I'm I'm dumb. Ignore me. Oh no, I didn't. That was first strike. Never mind. I forgot we were locked into first strike. Had to pass again. So there's not much that messes us up too bad here. We'll just take our beats. Seven, eight, nine. Lyra's not doing much here, unfortunately. It's not doing much to the point where I'm not even going to leave up Absorb to defend it. We're just looking for a sweeper. I don't care about Lyra. If they know about this, it's not as good. But it's still good here. Oh! Easy mode. Easy mode. Let's leave up Absorb. No craces from our opponent. They're not blue. Don't care about that. Alright, now we get to develop Dawn of Hope. Oh man, we're really doing it. Beat Triple Carnage Tyrant. This deck is great. <laughs> I'm really liking this deck. Just look at just all this. Re look at all these resources. Yep, they just they can't keep up with the resources. This is way better than Esper against the black green strategies. That's for sure. For sure. All right, final boss. Final boss. We only lost the first game. Yeah, who needs black when you have uh, like more sweepers? Stone Cold Nuts. <laughs> I say that all the time. We have the Stone Cold Nuts for a hand, and you just win. Oh, they have the Stone Cold Nuts? Is that what it is? No. Alright, I was expecting Terramander there. I didn't say hello to our opponent. Looks like they have a shock. Yeah, I'm going to assume they have a shock. Or opt. It looks like opt. A nice and slow opt. A rigorously slow... There it is. Okay. Let's hope this is blue-red and not Grixis. That'd be nice. I'm not going to play around a two-mana counterspell, I don't think. Especially how we're not actually doing anything anyways. Yeah, let's just run this out. Our next two turns are probably just counterspells. Once this is in play, their only answer to it is, like, blink of an eye? My bad, I should probably stop shuffling cards. Okay, it's a Phoenix deck then, so maybe no blink of an eyes at all, and this is just going to stick. This is where Settle the Wreckage is really good. I really want Tezzeret, I don't want to get rid of that. There's not many things we want to counter, but I could, uh... Well, they haven't found a phoenix. Okay. Might just do this now to dig. Save up three spells for a phoenix. Depends what their hand is. No, nope, they don't do it, so I think they want to save up three spells for a phoenix there. Oh, they don't want to. Okay. Maybe they just want to chart a course first to get some more cards. That's exactly what they do. The only thing I'm interested in countering is like more Electromancers at this point, really, or, uh... Damn. I was kind of hoping they wouldn't actually get... Yeah, let's get rid of this. There's a land.
Now we need a second white source. That's uh, kind of imperative. So they can uh, radical idea, and that's, that's that's about it that we know about. These can kill you, so you you got to respect the uh, lecture mancers. I've learned my lesson times a plenty. And found a phoenix. Yep, that explains the uh, uptick in pace from our opponent. They found a second phoenix. Well, this is just bad. Well, we don't have much time. Maybe it was greedy keeping Tezzeret, but... Rip. Not a white source. Not a white source. Not a white source. I'm gonna run out Tezzeret. It's better than our hand. So... The token's gonna buy us more time than kind of anything else. They can shock it, but... Uh, Tezzeret himself's just gonna buy us more time. Also, it adds to the graveyard for an Escanza flip. Looks like there was no shock. Okay. Curious if they try to kill us or kill Tez or guess they can do both. Nope, they don't they don't give a damn about Tezzeret. White source, please. Oh come on. <gasps> okay, there we go. Um I guess it's settle the wreckage or bust, because it's it's it can't be um Cleansing Nova. They can just come back. Okay. They actually respect Settle the Wreckage. So now we're in an interesting spot where we can make tokens and they have to keep swinging into Settle the Wreckage. Because it's not going anywhere. Or we could just die to double shock. Uh, they're stuck in combat? I don't know what's going on. Looks like there's no second shock. I don't know what they're doing. They cast a thing in their... Okay. Sure. Rip. We almost stabilized. I could have went for a cleansing Nova, but I mean the same outcome would have just died to that nonsense. Okay, attempt number two. We almost got there. If we had a white source earlier, that would have been great. Unfortunately, it was blatantly obvious we had Settle there because we didn't just scoop. And that's the only card that was good there. So it was a dead giveaway, and they started respecting it. And we were too low, where they could have just respected it completely. Like, if we did have a Revitalize there, we could have, I don't know, just taken three, not used it or something. Oh, Mono Red. Holy crap, you were right. Mono Red is going to be the last, the last deck to play against. Wow. Great. Great. It is literally the last deck. Ugh. Final boss, Mono Red. Opponent has use of all their mana. We're on the back foot. I guess I'll leave up counter magic next turn, and then the turn after that have my uh, settle the wreckage, which I imagine they will not play around. Oh my god. 
god. Okay, well, they're almost out of gas. We take eight. It's so ridiculous. Settle the wreckage, which I don't think they're going to play around. Okay, let's hope we stabilized. We have Teferi and Donifolk. Our opponent has eight lands. Don't want to see a, a, a Bane fire, that'd be funny. Okay. Keep up the pace. Let's leave up a uh, token. <gasps> oh my god, we stabilized. Oh my god. <gasps> Settle the wreckage. Doing it. Oh man, I did not feel comfort. I did not think we had it. Yes! Y'all taste it! Oh. Yes! Mono red. Was that you? I bet that was you. You were just waiting. <laughs> Mox Amber and a copy of a mythic we already got. Yes! Went the went the distance. Woo! Awesome. Oh, you should be sleeping. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. It worked, and some of those games were really good. I gotta admit, that was very fun. Um, Dovin's Acuity is probably gonna come in next time I do this, if I do this again, um, over, I don't know, something, but... Oh, that was a five-hour stream. Oh, well, thanks for watching. If you're watching on YouTube, and like and subscribe helps me out a lot. Whew. All right. <laughs> yes.